All right, this is Space Word Bird, and welcome to another YouTube video. Playing some video games today. Today, of course, we're playing some NBA 2K20, playing some My Team, and today, another budget blueprint video, where today we're looking at the new Diamond Prime VIP Doug McDermott. We're going to look at the card's profit potential in the auction house, yeah, and see if there's an opportunity to make some MT sniping and flipping this card. We're also going to look at the card's ability to improve your budget lineup, yeah, and see if we can get some wins with a two in triple threat online. And in one match, we'll get matched up against a super Super sweaty squad. Yeah, Opal Giannis, out of position, Opal LeBron James, and Opal Reward Thon Maker. Easily over 3 million MT spent on these cards. And that's where we're a little different. We love finding ways to do more with less. And we feel this Diamond Doug McDermott has some potential. Now, before we get started, now would be an amazing time to hit that like button. You guys have been continuously exceeding our expectations for support, and for that, we say thank you. And if you're new to the channel right now, would be the perfect time to hit that subscribe button. Our channel features only fresh and original my team no money spent content no ads for shady third-party mt brokers to sit through and definitely no clickbait just the best tips and tricks on how to have fun playing the my team game mode so first this card diamond doug mcdermott and its value in the auction house this weekend seeing several up for 2000 mt by now so really no need to set up a snipe filter to target it it is always mind-blowing how bad pack odds are even to pull a diamond from a 10,000 mt pack and then to see cards like this getting thrown away immediately remember diamonds and their quick sale value is 1500 MT. So with prices low like they are right now, it wouldn't hurt to put a few of these cards away to sell later after these prime packs are retired. What's the risk, right? The card quick sells for 1500 MT. And you could also look at bid sniping. And it's always easy to do day one when packs are released when the market is flooded. Now at this point of the weekend, there's always somebody out there that's going to bid up cards to that minimum 1500 MT buy now. But it's worth looking at and something to think about for future promos. Now let's look closer at this card. Doug McDermott, Doug McBucket, 6'7", small forward shooting guard, like the height to run him at the two. I played his college ball at Creighton and gets compared to another Creighton legend, Kyle Korver. Yeah, like Korver, McDermott is a threat from deep range. And this card is supported with elite shooting ratings and badges. 96 open shot three, 94 mid. Now, the card has 29 Hall of Fame badges, solid for a diamond. And all 17 of the card's shooting badges are Hall of Fame. And the other ratings on this card make Dougie more than a spot-up shooter like Kyle Korver. Yeah, the card has good athleticism and inside scoring, 88 speed and acceleration, 87 vert and 80 driving dunk. 88 strengths, so the card has the ability to absorb some contact when finishing in the paint. Now, the card's low passing vision does drop the card's overall playmaking, but the ratings that count are actually solid. 86 speed with ball, 86 ball handling, and that important threshold to get that little burst when moving with the ball. So the card definitely does not need to rely on passers to get him the ball to score. We'll show you that. Now, the knock on Dougie's game in real life was that he lacked the strength to be an NBA defender and lacked lateral quickness, and we see that reflected in the card's defensive ratings. Yeah, awful steal and block ratings, poor reaction and shot contest ratings, but the card's lateral quickness and interior and perimeter defensive ratings are good. They're just not great. But we want to show you that this budget card can be a solid pickup and can compete even with the sweatiest triple threat god squads. Now, today we're running Dougie with uh, and sticking with our budget blueprint theme, a card we featured in our last video. And Joe Chi, the Amethyst card, you can find an auction for under 2,000 MT. And today, checking out Flash MJ. We talked about this card in a video a couple of weeks ago on how we'd see this card's price rise in value. Yeah, then a couple of weekends ago, you could win Flash MJ off the triple threat online reward boards and it's priced this weekend now back up to over 12,000 mt in auction so let's run them game number one and right away getting into the super sweaty gameplay opponent has that out of position lebron james 1.5 million mt this weekend and he locked in the mt for that out of position set reward opal thon maker also running takeover Giannis and seeing this card now sell for over 2 million mt this weekend that is out of control now, the cost of our lineup just under 16,000 mt unless of course you sniped diamond mj i found it a handful of times for prices that are worth picking it up for to flip for a little profit. That's the little profits adding up to a big profit. And we'll get the game started here with Giannis, a green light mid and down four early. And nothing like spotting your opponent a little lead to start the game. And the sweat, it's real. Check it out. A full court press and triple threat online. Who does that? Beat the press easily with Dougie dropping MJ the dime on the basket cut for our first bucket of the game. And here, defense played perfectly, picking off the pass and then pushing the fast break. And the kick to MJ, left corner, and he would get the green light three. Joe here in the high post. The kick out to McDermott on the perimeter. Then Dougie uses Joe's movement off ball as a moving screen to get the wide open look from three. And that is a green light. All right, this full court press getting old quick. Uh, clearly not working as we've got Diamond Doug out ahead on the break. That gets the ball and takes it straight to the rack. The strong two-handed finish and more press break. Biggest tip not to panic. Be smart. Here get MJ the ball and again hitting Doug. Streaking to the basket. But this time Opal Giannis able to slow him down. But then watch what would happen next. Yeah, the 2,000 MT. 
MT card able to seal Opel Giannis and then goes above the rim. Another strong two-handed finish. But here, the team struggling a little on the defensive glass. All right, that's an understatement. Getting destroyed on the defensive glass. Now, Thon would miss the second attempt. So Giannis cleaning up. Third time's a charm. And that would light up the card's slasher takeover. And things starting to fall apart. McDermott misses on the open look from three. Now, Thon grabbing the defensive board. And then the long outlet pass to Opel Giannis. And then Giannis would get the left-handed layup to drop. Down three and continuing to deal with that full court press. The inbounds pass to MJ. Look at the players filling the lanes nicely. Joe down the middle of the court would kick out to McDermott in the corner. Look at the quick gather and then green light mid. Here Jordan on the attack. The kick out to Joe and gets Thon jumping. Joe finding some open space on the perimeter and then gets the green light three to tie the game at 17. We're going to have to work to get this win. LeBron here the green light mid and now just a bucket away from the win. An opponent continuing to apply the full court press. Inbound the ball to Doug McDermott and then would get fouled immediately. Quality off ball D here spotted on the weak side. The opponent trusting his CPU defenders and they would get confused on the pick and roll. Nobody picking up Joe on the basket cut and the reverse dunk and that big bucket is what we needed to tie the game at 19. So we'll need a huge defensive stop here. Yeah, and Doug not known for his strength and lockdown defense and we'll need him to step up here against Opal Giannis in the paint and Giannis would let the baby hook fly. Yeah, praying for that bailout animation would brick it. Joe the defensive board and then outlet to Dougie and Dougie cold-blooded lets it fly from three in transition and he got it that is ball game now taking down the three million MT God Squad here in triple threat online now to the reward board and nothing special a couple of MT spots and a token spot where it's at this weekend is triple threat offline with those mystery packs we have been accumulating a ton of those and planning on ripping through those Sunday night second game and a less sweaty lineup uh, campus legend Jimmer Fredette spotlight Jeremy Lin Carmelo Anthony and leapier Rudy Gay now pricing on these cards this weekend really quick always important to have that market knowledge so you can put it to work sniping and flipping cards leap your booty gay cheapest buy now is at around 30k spotlight mellow starting at around 50 and campus legend jimmer fredette can find this card starting at around 20,000 mt total lineup cost about a hundred thousand mt let's get the game started with doug mcdermott here at the green light mid now the card shot release is money and more greens with doug mcdermott here from limitless range he's got the team's first two buckets of the game and then here from the half court logo and mcdermott would get the three ball to rattle home then doug the playmaking on the perimeter creating his own shots here continue to let it fly from three and he got it for all 13 here in the game and now defense focusing their attention strictly on mcdermott rudy gay would leave his defensive assignment and that's joe letting it go with the green light mid it's diamond flash mj on the perimeter yeah quick to let the three fly and that is a green light but the game is close tied at 18 and joe would let the jordan bullet pass bounce off his chest rudy gay quick to recover the loose ball and then take it straight to the rack for that quick transition bucket so we'll need a big bucket and Dougie would step up here the corner three and that is a green light yeah he's got 16 of the team's 20 their opponent playing for the win lets the three fly and Jordan quick able to secure the defensive board and fast break defense able to get back so we'll have to work in the half court set the pass to McDermott in the corner and he has been almost unstoppable this game dribbles out and lets the limitless range three fly and it is a green light game winner yeah that is ball game some late game drama here on the triple threat online court now to the reward board three drops and nothing special a couple of 550 mt spots those are okay and a chance at a couple of gold consumable packs now what did we learn today uh that diamond doug mcdermott is a solid budget pickup definitely held its own on the triple threat online courts taking down the three billion mt god squad and then in game two carried and stepped up big at the end of the game you have to get the dub with that green light game winner no money spent plays to make diamond doug mcdermott's price definitely low at 2000 mt by now not going to get much cheaper than that so the smart play might be to put a couple of these cards away to sell later when these prime packs are retired low risk as the card quick sells for 1500 mt now likes greatly appreciated all the feedback we need to keep making more my team no money spent vids and subscribe so you're checking out that next video for party pete this is space we're out